my favorite part of looking at this hole, we got in this hole uh, uh, one billion dollars, uh, one trillion dollars on tax cuts for the rich under George Bush. We got into this hole two trillion dollars on two wars that we put mm -hmm. on a credit card for our children and grandchildren to pay off. And we got into this hole one trillion dollars on a Medicare drug program that A was not paid for and B is 40% more expensive than it needs to be because it was a giveaway to the drug companies. So we just have, I mean that's just four trillion right there. So part of the way you fix this problem is like don't do those things. <laughs> You know, well, this is class warfare, this is whatever. No, there is nobody in this country who got rich on his own. Nobody. You built a factory out there, good for you. But I want to be clear, you moved your goods to market on the roads the rest of us paid for. You hired workers the rest of us paid to educate. You uh, were safe in your factory because of police forces and fire forces that the rest of us paid for. You didn't have to worry that marauding bands would come and seize everything at your factory and hire someone to protect against this because of the work the rest of us did. Now look, you built a factory and it turned into something terrific or a great idea. God bless. Keep a big hunk of it. But part of the underlying social contract is you take a hunk of that and pay forward for the next kid who comes along.